Hello, everybody. Welcome to Drew in the Moment. Thanks for checking out the video today. We are here in Hollywood, Florida. We took a little road trip down to this area because we wanted to check it out. We've never been in the Miami area. So in this video, we're going to be going checking out the Hard Rock Cafe. We're going to be going to a farmer's market that uh, I heard is supposed to be pretty good. And also, we're going to head to the iconic Miami Beach. I'm uh, really excited for this trip. Thank you guys for coming along. I hope you enjoy the video. And uh, let's not waste any more time. Let's go check out the room here at the Cirque Hotel. Let's go. Nice little hotel room. I like it. Got some cool artwork over here. You know, keeping yeah, it pretty funky. Pretty nice. It is pretty nice, you know? It's a, the double bed so we can jump back and forth on the beds. Uh, but come check out this view. I want to show you something. Wow. Pretty nice view. And if we zoom in, you can see the hard rock guitar right there. Look at that. That thing is massive. Wow. That is massive. I was a little worried. I wasn't sure if they were gonna have coffee. Just kidding. We got a little coffee here. Ooh. Yeah, Hi. this is uh, Sonder. Sonder coffee. Never heard of it, but uh, definitely gonna give you guys a review on it. Uh, sounds good. I'm not gonna like, you know, do a big thing here in the bathroom. Obviously a toilet, obviously a sink, but I love these stand-up showers. You got a door there. That's awesome. Look at this. I mean, look at it. Look at me. But well, where's the shoe? Oh. It's very high. It's I, I literally looked over here and over here for the shower head. And it's above you. These are like the coolest, man. Because they just, they come right down and get you nice and clean. That's the thing. The birds are freaking out, man. <laughs> They're just excited we're here. That's what it is. That is insane. My God. That was so loud. have made it to the Hard Rock Seminole Casino, Cafe, all that good stuff. Check it out, man. I cannot, I can't even explain to you guys how huge that is. Like, you, you won't even be able to tell on the camera. That is gigantic, and it's got a cool, like, light that it's shooting up there. That's crazy. It is insane, and if you guys can see down here, we got a little, like, it's beautiful. little pool going on there, little cabanas. Look at the cabanas down there. That is insanely cool. I want to stay at one of those. Just beautiful. And it is a nice, a nice comfortable night. I actually am wearing a fleece because we're in the 50s. Can you guys believe it? What is going on? This place is huge. I had no idea. It's literally like a mall, but like way cooler than a regular mall. Like look at, look at the ceiling. Like that's just cool inside a guitar inside of a guitar have you guys ever been inside of a guitar because i haven't this is my first time Zen wall in here. This is a sand. So I found a better, a better fountain to make a wish. We're all gonna make our wish on this coin right here. Look how cool that is. That is insane, man. 
Love it. All right, here we go. I hope all your wishes come true. Or come true. <laughs> Sweet Caroline. Ba, ba, ba. This is Neil Diamond's car. His car. His, His car. car. His car. Seriously, this is Neil Diamond's personal car. It's a 1956 Ford Thunderbird. So awesome. He donated to it. He donated this car for charity. That is awesome. I love Neil Diamond. What's over here? So cute. Look at that. That is a beautiful photo op. Just in time for Christmas. This is too cool, a signed John Lennon jacket. Look at this. Signed right on the pocket there. That's awesome. This is awesome, man. Insane. So much fun. And I love like the reflection off the water. Know, right? It just looks so pretty. Look at like, this. Seriously, look at that. That is awesome, man. B -E -A, Very cool. a beautiful. Beautiful. All right, so we're gonna call it a night tonight. No, it's not the end of the video. This is just the end of our night. A uh, ton of fun here at the Hard Rock. This guitar show, very, very, very cool, man. Highly recommend uh, checking it out if you make your way over here. It's worth it. I think it was like 10 a 10 minute show, but really, really fun. And this place was way bigger than I thought it was. So my little legs are tired. Uh, so we're gonna head back to the hotel, get some sleep, and we will see you guys in the morning with a bevy in hand. I can promise you that. Good morning, everybody. And good morning, Hollywood, Florida. <laughs> Looks like another beautiful day. I think it's a little chilly out there. Hold on, let me dial up what the weather is. Let's see, our location. Okay, it's actually not too bad. It's 71 right now, uh, but it was 54 earlier this morning. Um, but yes, got my coffee, that's Sonoma, and it's not that good. <laughs> And, and honestly, I don't know about you guys, uh, I realized like the K-Cups, I thought were like kind of revolutionary. I'm like, oh, that's a great idea. It's real easy to throw it in. They don't taste that good. Um, it's coffee, I guess. <laughs> Not great coffee, but it's really watered down. But anyway, uh, I'm sitting here. I'm going to get uh, all jazzed up, ready for the day. Hope you guys are excited to come along with us. We are going to pop over to the farmer's market around here and uh, potentially do some other things throughout the day. So this is just gonna be a fun day hanging out with us. So uh, I hope you guys are ready and I hope you caffeinated. Let's go! We're here, let's check out this place. Let's check it out, it looks pretty wild. I don't know, I think it looks like it's all inside but I have no idea. So this is gonna be fun, we love our farmer's markets. I hope you guys love farmer's markets. These are awesome and visit your local ones. Support local businesses, can't say that enough. Look at this wow. place, man. Say stage. Look at stage. You got a cow over there. And Queen noticed, my lovely wife, 
little bit of uh, Peruvian, uh, Look at Peruvian this. love going Peruvian on here. Love here. Uh, it's so wild. So they have food for a lot of different countries. This is so exciting. It really is. I, as soon as I walked in, I saw all that. I was like, holy cow. <laughs> some Brazil. Oh, they, you know what? It's always Arby's that says they have the meats, but I disagree. It's the Brazilians, right? The Brazilians. I am just in love with like the little seating area. I shouldn't say little, gigantic seating area. Look at that. This seating is awesome. You got like the, you know, the military grade uh, cover. I don't know if it's military, but I know the military uses that sort of stuff. This is so cool, man. All right, they're cooking up something good over here. I just know it. What? Oh. Let's investigate. Let's investigate. I can just smell. Look at that. That's the real deal, man. That's the real deal. Oh, yes. Smells so good. I wish I had smell-o-vision for you guys. Oh, my God. I'm hungry now. Look at the pork yeah. belly in there. Oh my gosh. $19 a slice. It comes with a rice. It looks yeah, so you know, good. Oh my god. <laughs> it's a Bruno, boy. yeah. A Bruno? Hi. So Bruno. Hello. Bruno. <laughs> awesome. a happy boy, huh? Okay, so now we're going inside the building. Like I said, I didn't know it was going to be inside. Yeah, and like, oh, oh look at it. It's the bartender right there. Hello. Hi. Hi. How much Peruvian stuff? <laughs> it's crazy. It's awesome, man. Yeah. Oh. And you know what? They got salsa. Some salsa, yeah. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> so I lost Drew. Let's see if I can find him. Oh, there he is. He just having the best time. <laughs> wow! I like That's how you play hopscotch. <laughs> I like that little spin you did. I did. I added that the last second. I was like, am I gonna regret it? Am I gonna pull my knee out? I don't know, but it was worth it and I went for it. Now I know there's a few of you that are like me where I had never heard of Shwarma until I watched Marvel <laughs> in the Avengers specifically. Uh, never actually tried it. I'm really curious though. Here is the menu, and I think we're gonna do it. They had a few different kinds of shawarma, chicken, prawn, but I'm guessing, we don't know, but I'm guessing this might be the best one. It's the beef one. I think we're gonna go with that, 16 bucks. So let's try that out. See if we like shawarma. I mean, look at the meats. Oh, just smelling the deliciousness. Oh, I'm really excited now. This is gonna be, I, I really think this is gonna be delicious. Ah, the good stuff. <laughs> so good. I am so excited. It smells so good. Yeah, thank you. Look at that. So they cut it by order. Cut it by order, so it's gonna be nice and awesome. All right, cheers for our salute, Slancha. We had to get a little bevy with our shawarma. Went with the Mexican Coca-Cola. It truly is, this straw won't go down. Uh, it truly is the best Coca-Cola because of the real cane sugar. Every time, I'm telling you. Way better than uh, the Coke we have here in the States. Mexican all day long. But look at how beautiful and these french fries they look good they look so crispy mm. those are delicious and then i think it's just mayonnaise and ketchup right i'm guessing i think so i think so oh look at this let me, let me get it closer so we can see Shawarma. Here we go. So this is uh, my first time, our first time, trying shawarma. Like I said, never even heard of it until the Avengers. Uh, <laughs> shows you my ignorance, I guess. Yeah. I don't know. All right. Ooh. Look at that, huh? 
just beautifully done. Great presentation on this. All right. Let's take in his first bite. I think he like it. I think he like it. <laughs> it's so good. Oh my God. This is fantastic. Just like that, I think it was a, a reel or a meme or something, where the guy's like, I'll take 14 of these. <laughs> I will totally take 14 of these. These are delicious. Oh my God. There's so much flavor. I can't I can't even describe it. Drew has no words. I, I'm literally, for once in my life, I think I'm left speechless. It's just delicious. That's all I can say. It's delicious. Mm. Now what do you think? What do you think? Honest opinion. This is really good. Yeah? You know what? It has so much flavor. Yeah. Delicious. Approved. Right? You see what I mean though? Like there was a lot of different flavors going on that you can't I can't yeah, even the onions, the onions. The onions, so, yes. Delicious. Approved. You'd get it again? Would you like 14 of them? Because I know I want 14 of them. Yes. I am so full. You full? I'm full and I'm really excited because now I can say that I've I've eaten shawarma. I know what it is. You are not going to go hungry at this farmer's wow. market. Look at what they got going on here. It's like a huge production, man. Look at the meat. <gasps> oh my God, I want to go see the meat. Dude, that is amazing. No, that is just amazing right there. Wow. I just want to grab one of them and just snuggle up with it. <laughs> <laughs> just eat it all night while I'm sleeping. We are back inside now. Yeah, we are. There's just so much food, man. So I'm trying, much. I'm trying to find something other than food right now. Ceviche, the best Peruvian food ever. Go for it, Joe. Try a ceviche yeah. sample. Let's do this one. It's got more juice. For example. Yeah, spicy. Oh, she's got a good pick. Not good. Mm. Let's try some ceviche, and I know my ceviche. Yeah, and you won't make a mess like I did. <laughs> Oh, she made a mess like I did. <laughs> I told you. It's kind of hard. Ooh, this is delicious. Got a nice little kick, right? It's really good. Yeah. It has a kick. It needs to be spicy. It always needs to be spicy. I agree. Can yeah. I get them on the sample? Yeah, why not? <laughs> Just keep eating them. I am a huge fan of the black light shirts and things like that. Look at the Simpson. Got Bart up there. Oh, those are cool. Ooh, and they have a stitch one here. These are really cool. Wow. What you got there? What you got? Oh, wow. Right and vivid. Obviously, you got the black, you know, the black light going on. But yeah, these are really cool looking. Oh, that one's cute. Look at that. Ooh, wow. Those are cool as well. Look at this. Those are fun. Ah, a little one piece. <laughs> this is just awesome. What? Good way to recycle. That is so cool and in innovative. It keeps your drinks cold. It does. That is that is awesome. No way. We sell it two for 15. So two for 15, those are fun. That's a great idea. They got a nice little juice bar over here. You want to get a nice healthy drink? Yeah, real veggies. Real veggies, man, just straight up, right in front of you. That's awesome. Dragon fruit, blue low. Guava. 
It all looks delicious, man. It is healthy. For you pickle lovers out there, they've got gigantic, what that, 50, 50 gallon drum or something like that of New York pickles. Wild. There is some amazing things here, like this fresh pasta. Look at this. Carrot pasta, spinach pasta, beets pasta. Oh, gnocchi, love my gnocchi. Portobello mushroom pasta. Wow, oh, look at that. And the little trumpet. They look beautiful. These are beautiful. Really? Use the juices instead of vegetable. Oh wow, that's awesome. So she used, so she uses the juices from the vegetables instead of the water. This is rainbow fettuccine. 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 And we're gonna try it with pomada, pomada sauce. Pomodoro. Pomodoro sauce. All right. Yeah, vegetable. Yeah, yeah but it's, that, good. it's good. It's really good. Mm. Wow. All right, I got to sample this little guy right here. What's the flavor? It's Oreo flavor. Oreo? Oh my God. Macamon cheese, macamon cheese. Yeah. Oh, okay. Macamochi is what it is. Let's give this little thing a whirl. All right, we're gonna give it a whirl. Oh my gosh. That is delicious, it's smooth. That's really good. Surprise. It's adorable, first of all. Right? And that's smooth. That is delicious. So if you guys do come down, this is what they got for pricing. Very, very delicious. All right, this is pretty neat. This is pretty cool. I haven't heard of it. Pink pineapple. You know, and I and I don't know if it's any better, honestly. They taste like bubble gum. The, yeah, I mean, it tastes like bubble gum. I'm in, but I, I don't know if it really yeah. tastes any better or if it's just cool because it's pink. Either way, it's cool. But oh, hold on. What does it, it say? What does it say? Pineapple. So it tastes like pineapples and banana. Yeah, pineapples and bananas. Oh no, no, it says bananas. Oh, I thought it said bananas. <laughs> <laughs> I said bananas. Right here is some sugar cane. You can buy a sugar cane stick for $5. $5? Yes, yeah, but I really want to buy one, but I can't because we have like, <laughs> if we were going right home, I would, but. You can bring it like a cane. You can bring it like a cane while I'm like eating sugar out of the top of it. So the overview I will have on the farmer's market, it was more of a food palooza. Yes. <laughs> you know? No, for real, like it was just, a lot of food which i loved and it was a lot of good food a lot of different options uh so a little less of a farmer's market they had elements in there but it's basically like yeah. you're coming you want to get your eat on uh, definitely come down place, yes it is but we had a great time finally tried some shawarma and it's delicious i highly recommend it do you feel like at at vineyard i do i gotta do my, my uh, <laughs> superhero landing ready superhero landing <laughs> I do. I feel like that. I'm full of shawarma and uh, yeah, it was a great time. I've decided to take a little uh, trip up to the 12th floor here at the hotel. As you guys can tell, the insane views. We're quite high up here. That is for sure. But I wanted to show you they have not only like a bar restaurant here, but... They've got a rooftop pool as Veronica's over there dipping her feet in. But I will tell you, because of, uh, it's been, <laughs> it's been, she's freezing because it's been, uh, a, we've had like a cold front come through. I was hoping the pool might be heated, but it is not. It is pretty cool, like cold, uh, but it's also cool. But I mean, a rooftop on the 12th floor, I might later, just jump in real quick just to say I did it. I don't know though. It's pretty cold. It's a nice pool though, and it's uh Is it making you sad that uh we we potentially really can't go in it? It's too cold, I know. Like it really is quite cold. Uh I don't know. We'll we'll see. I might by the end of our trip here, you know, 
just jump in just to say I did it but I wanted to show you guys this is pretty cool as we are near the ocean but before we show it the ocean like seriously it is so high up here it makes me a little bit uneasy I'm not a scared <laughs> I'm not like afraid of heights or scared of heights uh, it's just that natural reaction to uh, being up this high but yeah right out there you got the ocean and if this pool water is cold, I'm pretty sure that ocean water is pretty cold as well. But what a view up here, my goodness. Gorgeous. But it does show you how flat that Florida actually is. Because you can see for miles. So leaving the pool right here, wanted to show you guys the, uh, you know, restaurant slash kind of bar that they have here. Beautiful. How you doing, man? <laughs> it is beautiful. Look at the look at the seating here. Once again, just an absolute gorgeous view. So I don't know. Maybe we'll uh, make our way up here later. Who knows? Who knows what could happen? Oh man. Yep. Oh, I got my finger in the shop. That's all right. But yeah, we actually, right next to the building here, we have a Publix, a, uh, you know, a grocery store, in case you're not familiar with Publix. Got a grocery store right down there, so anything we need, it's like two minute, a two-minute walk. Good morning. This is day three of our trip. Got my coffee. Got to wake up. Uh, Got to get the sleepies out. Today we're going to be heading over to Miami Beach and checking out that area. Pretty excited about that. We've obviously never been to Miami, because, which means we've never been to Miami Beach. So we're going to take you guys along. So that'll be fun. We're going to go venture over there. Uh, but before we head out, I wanted to show you guys, this always amazes me. These guys right here doing the window washing. They are up, I don't know, let's say the 14th floor. That is insane to me. There's no way I would ever do that. I mean, I understand it's all attached and everything, but it's just too sketchy, man. It's too sketchy. I don't know. Let me know if you guys would do that job. Uh, but anyway, all right. So we're going to go jump in the car. And we're going to head over to Miami Beach. So uh, thanks for coming along for the journey. here in Miami Beach. Uh, it's a little bit of a breezy day, but it always is near the ocean. So sorry if the audio is not perfect, but yeah, we're gonna just check out the ocean. It looks nice and blue and we are on the hunt. We don't know if we're gonna be able to find it, but apparently uh, some artists, I guess, made a whole bunch of like elephants. I don't even know what they made out of, but there's a bunch of them on the beach. So with, uh, you know, with good vibes, we'll be able to find it, but let's go, uh, let's go see how beautiful the Miami beach water is. Come on, let's go. I was not personally prepared for the beach today because uh, it was a little cool, but I gotta say, the water is surprisingly warm. Like, it's supposed to be like 80 degrees in the water right now, and it's not even 80 degrees in the air. That's pretty wild, but check it out. They got a hang glider over there. I'm gonna come touch the water. I wanna see if they were true, because it says 80 degrees. Let's see. Let's see. Ooh, that's actually really, really nice. It's not like Maine Ocean right now. Holy cow, man, freezing up north, but it's actually surprisingly warm for the Atlantic. Because the Gulf side, it can be warm to stay warm, but this is the Atlantic, and uh, I wish I had brought my swim trunks. Next time. We've got an iguana just chilling on the sand. This is crazy. Look at him. He's just kicking it. Okay, we saw a small iguana, but I want to show you guys a really large iguana. Holy cow, dude. Look at this thing. Oh my gosh. Guys, this is like... 
This is at least two and a half feet. Look at this thing. Wow. That thing is insane. That is gigantic. That is so cool. Oh. There he goes. Look at that. That is insane. <laughs> This is amazing. We're renting bikes. Uh, and it was $6.50 for half an hour. Not terrible. Obviously, you can get it for longer if you want. But we're riding bikes around. Look at the view of the ocean, if you can see it. So much fun. So much fun, man. I, I think the next time we come down, we're definitely gonna rent some bikes, or maybe even bring our own bikes. I don't know. Uh, but this is so relaxing. Such a nice time. Now, we are near the pier. Look at this view. They've got gigantic cruise ships down there. I'll tell you, I love Miami Beach. This is just gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. So we're going to go head out, walk out onto that pier and see what that is all about. It's so nice in here. I'm loving the breeze. So we're out on the pier. Gorgeous view. Sorry about the wind if it's a little windy. Got some folks here fishing. They did actually catch a couple things. Uh, we just missed it. Maybe we'll catch them catching something again. But man, this is just one big zen right now. Man, it's beautiful. So what do you think of Miami Beach so far? I love it. I do it's too. It's really pretty in here. It is gorgeous. And I know maybe it's a little off season and it is a Monday today. I don't know. But it doesn't seem too crazy. I mean, maybe it is crazy other times, but we got lucky. I mean, there's people here, people on the beach, but not like... For November, this is wonderful. This is perfect. Yes. And it's a beautiful day today. Absolutely beautiful. Nice, light breeze. So we will definitely be definitely coming back to Miami Beach. Nice. Absolutely. Looks like as we're leaving Miami Beach, we got like huge kites in the air. This is crazy. That is so awesome. And apparently it's at Hallover Park. Those are so cool. Wow. Good morning, everybody. It is the last day. We're actually checking out right now. We're waiting for the valet to bring our car around uh, because at this hotel, they only have valet. They had no parking, but anyway. Uh, so we're gonna head over on our way out over to a diner that looked pretty cool. So we're gonna go eat over there, show you guys the diner, uh, and then head back home. I did want to let you guys know, because I forgot to tell you, we were looking for those elephants yesterday at Miami, <clears throat> at Miami Beach, excuse me, uh, at Miami Beach, and uh, they were not gonna be out until November 28th, and it is not November 28th, so we weren't able to see them, but anyway. I want to let you guys know we never found the elephants. So, uh, but let's uh, get in the car and we're going to head over to the diner. So here we are at Jack's Diner. This looks very reminiscent of, uh, you know, diners that we have up in New England. I am from Maine originally, in case you didn't know. Um, but in Florida, I haven't found a bunch that like have this vibe going on, like the, the real diner look, you know what I mean? They have diners, but they're just different. They don't always come across as uh kind of like vintage almost you know but uh let's go head in and get some uh get some diner coffee and get our eat on the best diner coffee nothing beats diner coffee does it that's it 
<laughs> so I definitely need some coffee this morning. Gotta wake up. But cheers, Frost Salute, Slancha. This has been a wonderful trip. I hope you guys have enjoyed the journey with us. <sighs> Can't beat that a coffee. So I got my over easy eggs. I got my sausage links. I always go with the sausage sausage links over bacon, believe it or not. But if they have sausage patties, I always go bacon. Because there's more. These these are better. These are better. Links are better. And some hash browns. Good old hash browns. And some rye bread. Oh. <laughs> so now we're going to dig in. All right. That is going to do it for our video, our little video trip. we got to start heading back home. we got about a three and a half hour drive. Thank you guys for checking out the video. We, we really hope you had fun with us. We had a ton of fun. If you did enjoy it, don't forget to hit that subscribe. Boop the like button. Leave a comment. Uh, I want to thank you, and I want to thank all of our Patreons for all you guys' continued support and everybody that's been with us on this journey on YouTube. So, guys, cheers, prost, salute, slancha. Till we see you next time, remember, only one way to live. In the moment. In the Bye, moment. Guys.